welcome back to my channel so in today's video as you guys can see from the title of the video i am going to do cupcakes i'm just gonna make simple vanilla cupcakes with butter i mean not buttercream cream cheese um frosting so yeah i'm excited for that make sure to like and subscribe to see more of me yeah let's get right into to the video so i'm gonna go ahead and set up all the ingredients and then i'll be back and i'll show you guys because it's gonna be much more easier that way so we are going to need a cup and a half of flour we're gonna need one teaspoon of baking powder we're gonna need one and a half teaspoon of baking soda we're gonna need one fourth teaspoon of salt one tablespoon of vanilla extract three four cups of milk we're gonna need one cup of sugar two eggs and a butter stick unsalted butter stick so we're gonna start off with all the dry ingredients so we're gonna start with a cup and a half of flour one teaspoon of baking powder half a teaspoon of baking soda one fourth teaspoon of salt and we're just gonna go ahead and give this a quick whisk so in this bigger bowl we're going to sift the dry ingredients and basically you just get a um I don't know what they call the drainer. I don't know. <laughs> but you're going to need one of these. This one's a little too big. I couldn't find a smaller one. So basically, we're just going to put it on top of the bowl. And pour in all the dry ingredient. And basically, we're just going to give it a quick shake. So these are all the dry ingredients. And now we're moving on to the wet ingredients. This is where we're going to add all our wet ingredients because we're going to add the dry ingredients into the bowl so we can get it all mixed up. So, so we're going to start off with one butter stick. And so these have to be room temperature. We're going to go ahead and put this in the microwave for 10 seconds. So you know it's room temperature when you put your finger... Oh gosh, yeah. That what's hap that's what happens <laughs> so we'll go ahead and put that butter in there so next we're gonna go ahead and add the sugar but first we're gonna mix the butter just a little bit not too much now we're gonna go ahead and add the sugar So now we're going to go ahead and add our two eggs, but we're going to make sure we do one at a time. Now we're going to add the other egg. <clears throat> so the way you can get the eggs room temperature is basically you just put them in a bowl of warm water and have them just chill in there for like literally like five or ten minutes and they will get room temperature. And now we're slowly gonna add the flour. So the baked batter should look something like this. So it's gonna be very easy to add them in the onto the cake pan. So we're gonna get this ready. We're just gonna butter it up and put some flour. So we're just gonna get cold butter from the fridge and rub it in here on each one. And we're gonna grab some flour and basically. Okay, we're gonna add some flour. The oven is ready. look something like that this is just like like a soup spoon I guess one on each so 
we're gonna go ahead and put them in the oven. So the oven is preheated at 225 and I just added 25 minutes of how much it's gonna be in there for how long it's gonna be in there but obviously we're gonna keep checking on it now i have to clean up the mess so now we're gonna clean up the mess so we can get started on the so we can get started on the frosting yeah so ah my finger all right so i'll be back you guys and we'll just keep i'll update you guys on how the cupcakes are looking at so now we're gonna move on to the cream cheese frosting and you're gonna need a whole eight ounces of butter i mean <laughs> butter cream um cream cheese and excuse me for my nails guys but like i haven't painted them <laughs> and they look really really good right now and with the spatula i'm just gonna go ahead and soften it after we're done softening that we're going to add one butter stick not completely well actually we're gonna put the whole stick in but we're gonna break it down into pieces so I'm gonna probably add two little pieces and then we're gonna start mixing Okay, hand mixer There's another piece and there goes another and we're just gonna cut the last little oh there we go butter is gone moving on to icing pow basically powdered sugar so we're gonna use powdered sugar and we're gonna use one cup and we're gonna go ahead and add a little bit and we're gonna scrape the sides hip picks look like that I'm gonna give them a little bit more time so I'm gonna add about 15 more minutes Now we're gonna go ahead and add some vanilla extract. We're gonna add one teaspoon. So we're gonna set this right here and I'm just gonna go ahead and clean all this up and I'll be back. So it's been about seven minutes and I'm gonna go ahead and check if they're all ready. Looks like they are. Ooh. We're gonna let them cool down for about 10 minutes before I take them out. I wanna show you guys how easy they are to come out. So basically, you, I run a knife through the edges to just make sure they're not stuck to the pan. So basically, I just like grab it with my hand or you can also use the knife to lift it. Ta -da! And like I said, I don't have any of the cupcake liner. So I'm going to take out a few more and then we'll get to putting on the frosting. So I'm going to add one drop of food coloring. And this is red. So it's going to be... Oh, oh shit. So the food coloring is going to be light pink. There it is. Probably should have added another one. So see how it looks like pink? I'm going to go ahead and add another drop. So since I don't have a piping bag, I'm just going to use a regular Ziploc bag. And these are kind of fucking weird. But I'm going to have to work with them. Like, they're like that from the side. So I found a different Ziploc bag. Thank God I found it. And I'm just gonna go ahead and put this in there. This is what we're looking for, so you can just cut that piece. So you can cut it tiny or just cut that whole piece. But I'm gonna cut that much and see how this works out. So here's our cupcakes.
Damn. And you can add like anything on top. Like if you want anything on top of them, like strawberries or just a piece of fruit or any garnishing that you want to do. So this was the results of the finished cupcakes. They look so fucking cute. So yummy. Like when I tell you that they're moist, they have flavor. The frosting, I love the cream cheese frosting. It's so fucking bomb. And they're just simply easy. Yes, guys, that's the finish of it. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure to comment if you have any suggestions or, um, yeah, so just subscribe if you guys want to see more of me. I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye.